Hi, this is Dr. Keith Abloh with another Pain to Power video. This one is about personality testing. Uh, it's easier than you'd think. It's more important than you might believe. And the reason is because if you look at the wide swath of characteristics that define people, there actually are recurring characteristics that people display that will have a major influence on how they relate to one another and how they relate to themselves. Now, this isn't trading insight for analysis, data analysis, much to the contrary, the kind of personality testing that you want to do and which now I offer um, on paintopower.com. The kind of personality testing you want to do is the kind that allows you to understand more about yourself. S-E-L-F, we always put it in capital letters at Pain to Power more about yourself so that you can determine, are there patterns that I'm displaying, whether it's being especially confident in certain situations and not in others, or whether it's the type that you seem to be, where do you feel more comfortable? What role do you really like playing on a team, for instance, at work? Uh, who else, if for instance, you own a business, and you administer these very quick, some of these are 15 minutes, others are a little bit longer, but these very quick tests, what kind of composition of a team do you want? Who can you optimize on the team by virtue of understanding? Are they somebody who wants to take the lead? Are they somebody who, want to play, who wants to play a support role? Um, do they mostly value um, being uh, given frequent, and positive and insightful uh, comments, feedback? Uh, or do they want to go it alone and see how far they get on their own steam? These are all things that can help you as a leader looking at your team, but they can also help you as an individual. Whether you have a business or you don't, you are the business, right? You are the person running your life. And if you can get data, data is so important. Again, it's not in any way to the exclusion of empathy, understanding, and narrative thinking. I have tremendous respect, and in fact, the most respect for narrative thinking, that you're a story. But if we can gain some insight into the main character with a quick tool that really works and has been validated, validation is so important. It's been validated across millions of people who've taken the tests. And those folks have therefore given us insight into, well, listen, we gave it to so many people. Now we understand because we know who these people are in bigger ways, what kinds of successes they've sought, what kind of success they've met with, what kind of relationships they've had, uh, what have been the difficulties, what have been the joys. We know these other things about these people then a correlation is made between their answers to these questions and these other aspects of their life. And because of that, you can then drill down in your life and say, well, since they've looked at so many people, now I can look at myself on that spectrum. And my answers to these questions are very likely to correlate, not prove, but correlate with things I should think about about myself. Again, the arenas in which I'm most likely to perform best, the ways in which I communicate most powerfully and less powerfully with other people, some areas in which to grow, uh, because we're all, what are we all? We're all stories. We're all in a constant editing process, which we don't want to resist. We want to welcome it. Why? Because, as I tend to say at the end of these videos, your story matters.